be sure that they have that. Now, there are many things we could talk about raising your children in the West, but one of the most key things is for you to live as a Muslim. Because how would it be that you're telling the children to do something that you don't do? And how would it be that you tell uh, anybody that this is Islam and this is Islam, but you don't follow it? And one of my CDs, some of you have probably heard it before, but I'll share it with you again because the kids get a kick out of this. That the guy who's at work, maybe he comes to one of our programs, so he decides tomorrow when he goes to work, he's going to really lay it out and tell all of his non-Muslim friends about Islam. He's going to really lay it out to them. So he tells them, there's only one God and Muhammad's his messenger and I have to tell you about this and this is what's Islam and here's some pamphlets to read. And then after lunch they come back to him and they say, listen, I got a question for you. Yes, yes. Well, you give us that pamphlet this morning uh, talking about Islam. Now, what is this thing called salad? No, no, it's not salad. It's salat. Salat. Oh, okay. Well, what anyway was that? Well, that's where we stand and bow and prostrate. It said you have to do that five times a day. Yep. You have to do it in the middle of the day? Oh, yeah, right after lunch you do it, and then mid-afternoon you do it. Well, you've been working here in this company seven years, and we never saw you do it. <laughs> oh, well, uh, I, I'm a Muslim, but... Uh, <laughs> But, but I don't, uh, I don't, I, I don't pray. You don't do that? But that says you can't be a Muslim if you, well, uh, Allah knows my heart. Yeah, I see. Well, what's this other thing down here called Sam Ramadan? No, no, that's Sam Ramadan. Whatever. You don't eat, you don't drink. During which month? Well, it's the lunar month called Ramadan. Well, when is it? Well, actually, it's right now. Oh, so uh, you don't eat or drink. Well, uh, uh, what's that Pepsi doing in your hand? <laughs> well, I'm a Muslim, but, but I, don't, uh, I, I don't fast. <laughs> oh. well, what's this other thing right here? It says zakat. No, no, that's zakah. Zakah. Purification of your wealth. You know, and you do that. Or, do you do that? Well, it's kind of complicated, and it's a fraction, it's two and a half percent, and I just, and I've had to pay income tax anyway, and I just don't, you know, so you don't give the money to the poor every year. Well, well, I'm a Muslim, but, uh, but, uh, okay, tell me about Hajj. No, no, it's Hajj. Well, whatever. It says here that every year, no, I'm sorry, once in the life of the Muslim, he has to do this thing. He has to go to Mecca, right? Is that right? Yeah. When he, when he has, when Allah makes a way, when he has the money, he, he should do it. Okay. Well, uh, did you do it? Well, well, uh, uh, you know, I really hadn't had the money or the time. I haven't been able to. Well, last year you took off a whole month and went to Disneyland with the kids. What'd you do? Tell off around Mickey Mouse? <laughs> well, you know, I'm a Muslim, but <laughs> I, 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 I'm a Muslim, but oh. So you're a Muslim, but. <laughs> well, that's an important part of an anatomy. Now all you need is a spine, some arms, legs, and head to go with that Muslim butt of yours, and you'll be all right. <laughs>